Mary from Denmark, a few days later, appeared solo for the first time after the photos of Federico and Genevieve Casanova. With her appearance and behavior, she sent several messages that did not go unnoticed. Two weeks after Lecturer's magazine exclusively published photos of Federico of Denmark, 55, and Genevieve Casanova, 47, walking together in Madrid, Mary of Denmark, 51, made her first solo appearance. She has since attended events accompanied by her husband, King Felipe and Letizia when they were in Copenhagen on a state trip, her mother-in-law Queen Margaret and her son Christian. But he had yet to appear without any of them. Until now. This Tuesday, Mary of Denmark attended a gala reception for the Vietnamese community in the Danish capital. Frederick of Denmark's wife knew full well that all eyes would be on them. After the media frenzy caused by the photos of her husband with Genevieve, all of Maria's movements are analyzed in detail, as they are the best reflection of how she would feel at the moment. In this image it was no less, because although he was only seen for a few seconds, his gestures spoke for themselves. An image with a message from Maria from Denmark. On the one hand, one has to talk about the image of Mary of Denmark. If members of the royal family never leave their outfits to improvisation, this time the situation was no exception. Messages can be conveyed through clothes and everyone can express their feelings. Well, Mary of Denmark this time chose a festive dress in which the most attention was drawn to its color, for her solo outing, the Danish princess chose burgundy color. A tone that is synonymous with strength, elegance, individuality. Instead of choosing neutral or more muted tones, he chose one of the boldest, and it may well be a declaration of intentions about the strength he seeks. To convey in these moments. Her hairstyle also deserves a special mention. The fact that Mary of Denmark chose to have her hair done is also no coincidence. Federico's wife wore a hairstyle that left her face open. A way in which he did not hide in any way the gestures made by his face, Mary of Denmark smiles again. Among them stands out the smile of Mary of Denmark, who entered the hall where this reception was held. The princess did not stop smiling from the moment she arrived until she greeted the guest and also as she listened to the hymns being sung there. The stance was far from the one he had on the first day after the pictures of Federico and Genevieve, when his serious face spoke for itself, moreover, there was something to console Mary of Denmark in this first recital after the scandal that had developed around her husband. When he entered the hall where the gala dinner was being held, he received a storm of applause. Those present broke into applause for a few seconds, a gesture for which she was grateful and which would have given her even more confidence in this moment when she knew full well that she was the protagonist. In short, Mary's attitude from Denmark was very different from what she had shown in her previous performances over the past two weeks, where she was always accompanied by her husband Federico, and her attitude was much more serious.